What's going on you guys? JT Boxing Home Workouts. Today we are going to go back to guided rounds. So for a section of each round, we're going to have a theme that we focus on. And I'll be working with you and guiding you through that theme, giving you some ideas as we go, but you're mostly independent doing your own thing exactly, specifically, it's up to you. But we're working together to sort of get through this workout. Today it's eight rounds with a one minute break between each round. So here's how it's gonna go. For the first 45 seconds, you're working variations off the jab and the right hand. It could be jab, straight right, double jab, overhand right, jab, right hook. You just kinda wanna get into working bam, 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 boom, jab, right hand. We'll go that for 45 seconds. Then the next 45 seconds, we're working on ducking. So you're gonna go punch, duck, punch, and then you can move. And then punch, duck, punch. Just really getting yourself used to ducking. Now, when you duck, you can take a step and create an angle. You can duck and hold your ground, or you can duck out and move. So there's a lot of ways that you can work this duck and be creative with it. That's why sometimes we focus in on the theme because you can expand and become creative within that theme and that's how you really internalize your boxing and sort of own it as opposed to being told exactly what to do all the time. In the next 45 seconds, we're working on footwork. Your Muhammad Ali, bam, 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 in and out, to the side, bam, 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 pivots, bam, bam, step offs, okay? Just be busy with your feet. You don't have to do as much punching. Make sure your feet are working and they're busy. In the final 45 seconds, you're on the inside. Bam, bam, pivots. Boom, in close, boom, 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 huh, huh. You're busy, you're going to war. You're gonna make sure that you outwork your opponent, outwork this heavy bag. Then we get a full minute break and we go at it again. If you're not sure what to do, you know, you start with something simple. And once you start doing that simple thing enough, you're gonna get bored, that's how you get creative. So in the following rounds, you're working on more speed, adding more elements, or making something better, making something faster, or just working on something you like, because while you're doing that, you say, oh, I, I like that, that feels good, and then you can go back to working on it. So this is a great way for me to guide you, train with you, but also really make this boxing more your own. All right, anyways, let's get into it. All right, you guys, so for the first round, it's jab, right hand. It can be a double jab, by the head. You could throw overhand right, hooked. All right, just get yourself warmed up, really start to feel things out. You don't have to go too crazy. Then we're gonna get into ducking, all right, and we're gonna start to expand on our boxing. Really just get into the different vocabulary, different aspects of boxing. All right, let's work it. 45 seconds. Maybe something feels good, you wanna work it more, or you feel like you need work on it. Try different things. Jab and right hand variations. Uppercut counts too. Right hand variations. Okay, now we're gonna work on the ducking. Just get into it. Use those legs. You're gonna feel this. Really works the legs to get down there. Work the duck with a step. Or duck your way out. And then come back in. Have fun with it. All ducking. All right, ready, footwork, you're moving around. In and out. You're moving. You're never in one place. You're busy. You're moving. Stay busy. Pivot out. Step off. Pivot, pivot, in and out, 
Light on your feet. All right, on the inside, in close. Stay in there. Change the angle. Stay busy. All right. There it is, round one. That's fun, hey, that's fun. Oh, I really enjoy that. You know, sometimes, you know, you mix it up, get the guided combos, then we get some more freestyle in there and you try things, try different things. But we have a focus, right? So we're not, it's not like you're lost. You know what you're supposed to do. And if you're not sure you work on something basic until it becomes boring, and then you think, oh, maybe I need to add something. And you slowly start to add and experiment and really internalize this boxing because it's your mind doing it more so than you being told. All right, breathe and relax, enjoy yourself. We got a nice whole minute to relax. I'm gonna do the next round southpaw, but all the same themes, so if you want, you can do that as well. Try it out. It might feel weird, or if you're southpaw, do it orthodox. Sometimes it's good to mix up, balance the body out. Okay, we got eight rounds of this today. All right, here we go. Jab right hand. Jab or double jab and right hand. Mix it up. Have fun with it. Breathing. All right. Ducking now. Work on your ducking. Oh, I got to make that more smooth. There you go. Work on the head movement. Ducking out. Work in the jab. Yeah, there we go. That feels good. Keep working it. Get low. Okay, footwork. You're on the move. You can't be touched. You're light on your feet. You can't be touched. Pivot out. And move. Light on your feet. Keep working. Inside, here we go. You're busy. Working it. Dig to the body. Cover when you're done. Cover when you're done. That's it. Get in close. Those uppercuts can be short there if you want. Stay in there. All right. Woo. <laughs> That's fun. These are fun rounds. I enjoy this. I enjoy this. You know, give yourself a focus, but 
be free within that focus. You know, and I have other workouts like this on my channel where I mix combos and themes. And then on my Precision Striking channel, Saturday 11 a.m. East, Saturday 11 a.m. Eastern live streams there where uh, we're working on themes and working on ways to focus your boxing. All right, this way you can, you're not held back by the combo sometimes. Sometimes the combo limits the intensity. You just go and go and go. Or if you need to slow down, you slow down. All right, breathe, relax, enjoy yourself. Here we go. Now you're feeling warmed up. You start to pick it up a little bit. Get the intensity going. Set up that big right hand. Set up the big right hand. You go the body with it too. You go down, go down the body. Bring the jab at the end if you want. One, two, ba, ba. Jab right hand, combos. Bring that hook. All right, here we go. Working ducking. Punch, duck, punch. And then get out. Ducking can really take it out of you. Working those combos. Working the duck. That's it. One, two, duck. One, two, three. All right, ready. Movement. Movement. Can't be touched. You can't be touched. You light on your feet. Then you're out. And quick and you're out. Quick in your quick. Bah, whoa, whoa. Have fun with it. And you're gone. And move. You can give him that bladed stance. All right, get to work on the inside. You want to go. Move your head still. Dip and pivot off. Dip. Cover up, cover up. They attack. You attack back. Cover and move. Stay in there. Uh, work them. Uh, all right. Oh, this is flying by. Round three. Enjoy yourself. Breathing. Relax, 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 relax. Relax, relax, relax. Ah, feels good. Round three, now we're getting the groove. Now I can feel myself starting to get warmed up, get going, so you can add a little more speed, more power. But if you do, you need to recover, and just take a few extra seconds, it's okay. And then, and then take a few extra seconds, okay? Whatever you're working on, put, put your mind and your whole spirit into it. Huh. Okay, ready? Here we go. Round four.
You can add a little bit of head movement too, if you want. Don't deviate too far from the goal, okay? Jab right hand. Jab right hand. Okay, ready, ducking. Duck. Duck or move. Get the legs. Legs in the back involved. Everything's involved. Put it all in there. Duck your way out. That's it. Put it together. Okay, move. In and out. Step off and you move. And move. Don't stay in one place. And you're gone. Keep it up. Keep moving. Okay, hold your ground. Get in there. Hold your ground. Stay in there, inside. Cover, cover, cover. Work it. All right, round four. Ah. Ah. All right, we're working, we're working. And we're halfway. Still peaking, still peaking. Maybe around five or six. We get to that peak, and then seven and eight, we're just pushing it out from there, depending, depending on, you know, make sure you get a good warm up before you do these. It really helps round one and two get going a little bit better. Sometimes you start out too cold, you're slow, and by the time you're warmed up, workout's over. Breathe and stay loose. Relax your hands inside your gloves. All right, have fun with this. Be creative, own your boxing, own your boxing. So when you're on your own, you can still internalize these moves and know what they're for, the techniques. Ready, here we go. Jab right hand or jab left hand if you're southpaw. And move. Jab in the right hand. Hooks, overhand. Body shot. Okay, ready, ducking. Duck. Punch, duck. Punch again.
Jump. Boom. Moving. You're not in one place. Jump. You can't be touched. You can't be touched. You're too fast. You're too fast. Light on your feet. But you're still on the offense. You still attack. And move. Pivot out. Don't stand still. Don't stand still. Inside. Let's go. In close. Work. Change the angle. Change the angle. Come up the middle. You change the angle with your head by moving. Change the angle with your feet. And set it up. Get in close. Get in close again. That's it. All right, great work. Great work, great work. I think that's round five. Round five in the books. Okay, now my lungs starting to feel it, but I still got lots of energy. Hope you do too. Finish these last three rounds. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be fun. Just be creative, just be creative. Try new things, see how you feel, or something feels good. Just work it a few times. Yeah, uh, uh, uh. internalize it. Relax your hands again, breathing. Uh, we got 15 seconds left to really uh, just enjoy, enjoy this relaxation time. So long, lots of recovery. Round six coming up. Here we go, we're gonna get going. Ready, jab right hand. You can be two of them in a row, jab right, jab right, whatever you want. Bring in the body shot, hook to the body. Right hand downstairs, straight right hand. You can work on it technically like clean or just work on speed or a little bit of both. That's it, just work it. All right, here we go, ducking. The bag will move when you duck, so you gotta adjust to it. And there's ducking with footwork, and ducking in your place, and then ducking where you entirely get out. All right, mix them all up. Move the head, move the head. Move the head, duck. Your ducking makes everything better. Okay, footwork. Footwork focus. Makes your footwork better. Slipping better, because you work your whole body. Okay, light on your feet, moving. Faking. And you're gone. Switching. Left and right. Pivot it up. Step through. Step through. That's working good for me. I'm gonna work on that. One, two, three. Okay, get inside. Get inside. 
Change the angle. Change the angle. Use the head. Head off the center line. Or cover. Or in the Philly shell. All right. Woo. Feels good. Feels good. Feels good. Two more rounds to go. We're going to go at it because we're feeling alive. But well, make sure you take this time to enjoy your break. Take full advantage of this minute. Let your oxygen recover. Lactic acid clear out. Hands relax. You got to make the most of that minute. Okay, ready? You're gonna come up. Start round number seven. All right, here we go. Working it. Set up that big right hand. Set it up. And then move. Find that angle. Jab right hand, left right hand. Work it. <laughs> Give me more speed, more power, whatever you're focused on. <laughs> All right, ready to work ducking. Move the head. Move the head after you punch. <laughs> you can even move it before you punch. It's a little bit harder. Duck. <laughs> Almost like gazelle punch. Duck. Any punches will work. That's it. Duck and move. Hit and duck. You can even do halfway ducks. Halfway. Lomachenko styles. All right, here we go. Footwork, moving. Light on your feet. Faking. Fake low like Sugar Ray. Boom. Then come high with the big overhand right. And then move. In and out. Ba, ba. You're in and out. You're in and out. You're in and out. And move. Hands up. Have fun with it. Have fun. Okay, get inside. Let's work. Get in there. Change the angle. Change the angle. Cover. Cover and move. Change the angle. Work up the middle. So move the head. Come around the outside. Cover when you're done. Cover. Pull if you want. Pull. Get back in there. It's in close. It's not comfortable. Yeah. All right. That was round seven, right? I think that was round seven. Let's see. I think that's round seven. We got one more round to go. So relax, breathe, 
Try to give it your all for this last round. A little, little bit more. Even if you've already spent it, go deep. A little, little bit more. Push yourself. You can always pull back if you've gone too far. But let's start off pretty strong and then see how it goes from there. Three minutes. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. I think we got the last one. Breathe and relax. Okay, ready? It's coming up. Let's go. We're going to go for it. Push it. All right. One, one, two. One, two. Working it. Get ready, ducky. Moving ahead, ducky. That's it, duck. Move the head. Bring the hands with you. Keep it up. All right, moving. In and out. Move it, full work. Oh, we got inside, inside. That's not it. All right, time, 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 time. Excellent work, you guys. Excellent work. Hope you guys feeling it here and here like me. I definitely worked hard. I can feel that. I hope uh, you really get a lot out of this in terms of owning your boxing, making it your own. So when you do the guided combos, Sure, it's maybe something new you didn't think about or it makes, takes your mind off the thinking so you can just go. And then every now and then, you got to use your own awareness of your skills to develop and to kind of dig into your vault and see what you know, right? See what you actually have uh, internalized. So this is a great workout for that. Also really good, sometimes when you go free, you get the heart rate and lungs up a little bit more, really get going. All right, you guys, make sure to check out First of all, hit the like button for me. I really appreciate that. Check out precisionstriking.com for instructionals on how, how to box. Coupon code is down below. Check out my other channel, Precision Striking. And I got live streams every Saturday, 11 a.m. Eastern. And what else? I think that's about it. In the meantime, keep your hands up, chin down, eyes on the prize. Woo!